going to get started with a um, OpenGL, or sorry, a GLFW window on macOS. And um, I'm just starting with, I just like to check that I can compile C code ahead of time. Um, so I've got this main.c, um, looks like that. And I'm going to use Clang. And we just compile that. And we're going to have this a.out. We run the executable. And it says hello. So that is working. And um, if you don't already have Brew, you know, Brew is, or Homebrew, is the package manager on macOS, the most popular one. So I'm going to use that to install GLFW. Um, there are probably, I'm sure there are other ways, of course, but this, I'm going to try this and see. It might be the easiest. Um, you are going to need, if you, if you do install Brew, um, it's going to install these, I forget what it's called exactly, these Xcode um, developer, it's like a developer toolkit or something, and you'll get a lot of stuff. So uh, if after that Vim and Git are not on your system already, I would, I would suggest, you know, um, installing them like this if they're not there. And uh, yeah, so let's try Brew install, of course, just uh, Google how to install Homebrew. Um, it's spelled homebrew like that if you don't have it already. So GLFW and enter. And this is going to take, probably take a little while. So, okay, so apparently that installed. And I'm going to want to check out what's in this directory here. So I'm going to copy that and bring that up in a new in a CD into that. Um, let me bring this up a bit bigger. Oh. And um, let's see what's here. LS 3.3, okay. LS, I've got a library and an include. So LS include is going to have probably your, um, let, let's just open this in the finder window. So yeah, we're going to have this as our header file and the library. So I am going to, um, let's see here, go into this include folder and try to get the um, PWD here, the uh, path. And so I'm going to add this to my uh, my um, C file, my C program. And um, so it's going to be include, and I'm going to use the parentheses, and slash glfw3.h. OK. Um, then what I need to do is, then I will need to go to the GLFW website. Well, you don't have to do it this way, but this is very easy. You click on documentation, and they have this um, example code right here. Uh, I'm not going to copy the include, because I already did that, and it's going to be different. Um, so then in Vim, I'm going to escape out of insert mode and hit, let's say, 6DD. It's going to delete the rest of those and uh, then go back into insert mode and paste this in here. And uh, let's see, it looks like it should be all right. Um, after this, let's just get rid of this. It doesn't really matter at this point. Um, and then after this, we need to figure out how to uh, link things up correctly um, when we basically when we write this command to um, compile it, we need to be linking things correct. Successfully um, done this to work. And one thing is you will want the path of the library, right? Uh, not just the header file. And uh, that is going to be in the compilation step here. So this is how I compile it using Clang. Got framework. Um, I'll try without this. Usually you include it. And yeah, OpenGL framework, R uh, code, and the library. And so yeah, hit enter. It is going to warn that it, uh, because OpenGL is deprecated on Mac OS. Still works though. But uh, anyway, so that should have made the executable. Open this up, and we've got a window, which is our goal to start with. I did just try this without uh, that framework without the core foundation, and it did work. 
Um, so I guess you can do that. Um, then another thing that you might want to do is to add W A L L. Yeah, it needs uh, with a capital W, and this will add more warnings to your compilation step. Um, it's kind of a good practice to do that. So, and it will work the same though, just as before. Yeah, so that's it for this video. Um, if you had any questions about more of the basic stuff, like um, how do I install Brew? Um, what are you doing with all this terminal stuff? Uh, how does C work? How does Vim work? Etc. Or any other ideas or things that you want me to make a video on, um, please go ahead and, and leave that in the comments. There's also my Patreon account that you can check out, link in the description. And if you want to help the channel grow, uh, liking, sharing, subscribing, and commenting all helps. So thank you very much for watching today and have a good one. Bye.